Hey guys, this is Joe over at Synergy 17 and today I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how I laser engrave a Yeti tumbler or any tumbler. So here's my logo. The first thing I want to do is um, I need to rotate it to face the correct way on the mug itself. So to the right here where this line is, that's the top of my uh, tumbler when it's in the laser engraver. So I'm going to take this and do negative 90 to turn it. Um, next thing I want to do is I'm going to hit P to center it in the page. And the reason I do this is because the center line here is wh where uh, the center of my tumbler, where the laser crosses over the tumbler attach, or sorry, not the tumbler, but the uh, rotary attachment in the engraver. So next thing I do is I'm just going to click it, hold shift, and drag it. And this line I made is approximately an inch and a half from the top of the tumbler. So I could adjust this later on and resend the job, or I can just edit it when it's uh, in the... Uh, control panel itself. So now that I have that set up, I'm going to say file, print, and um, within my control panel uh, properties for the laser engraver, I have the rotary attachment enabled. I have my diameter set for my uh, tumbler itself, and and then I have, my, of course, my uh, power and speed settings here. So everything looks good there, and I'm going to just hit OK, and then I'm going to print. So what this does here is this takes the job and spools it up uh, to the UCP, which is the universal control panel. So once that's done, I'm going to go into that control panel and take a look at some of the settings there just to show you what it looks like. So here it is. See, here's a straight line here. This is where the um, laser actually travels back and forth over the rotary attachment. So um, now that I have this perfectly lined up, I'll go video uh, how I put the the tumbler itself into the rotary attachment. Since it's going to get a little loud when the laser turns on, I'm going to uh, try to explain this before uh, you actually see the red dot. So the first thing I do is I just load the tumbler into here, um, into the attachment. And if you see where it says Yeti right here, I know the edge of the E just the right edge of the end of the E is kind of where the center is. So in general, I kind of get lined up right around there. So when the laser comes out, it's going to be right over the edge, and that's my center. And it's the same thing on the other side where it says Yeti as well. Uh, it's a little bit smaller, and it's not engraved. It's kind of embossed-like. And then um, also, I, I would just kind of rig this up and put a couple pieces of wood under here to lift it up. This way, since it's tapered, I just want a little bit flatter area. So. You know, this here I can you know lift up and down to to get it as flat as I want. So, anyways, I'll turn it on and I'll show you how I align it with the laser. So, as you can see right here, when I line it up, the red beam right here, the little pointer, is right there next to the edge of the E, so I know it's centered. So that way, I know my cup is perfectly uh, centered where I want once I do my start etching my graphic. 